Energy security is an essential issue for remote, off-grid communities in the Arctic. And they often rely on old diesel generators to produce electricity, depending upon costly transport of fuel through harsh conditions. The Tundra project aimed to pilot alternative, clean and reliable energy solutions in a remote Arctic community. The tundra needed reliable electricity at their largest reindeer herding station in Polomos, an off-grid site located 70 kilometers from Lovazero village, the Russian Sami capital. Lovazero is located in a remote part of the Murmansk region of the Kola Peninsula, with a population of just over 3,000 people. Сегодня мы находимся в самском селе Лавозера. Лавозера живут люди разных национальностей, очень многих национальностей. В основном местное коренное население это самы. Мужчины занимаются оленеводством, выпасают оленей в тундре. Женщины их, сестры, матери шьют национальную одежду для них, также занимаются рукоделием, делают вышивку из бисера. It was time to pack our snowmobiles and meet some reindeer herders on our way to Polos. Сад у нас выпускается на, на падвичах, вот. у них корм идет ну, ягельный. Вот. Reindeer culling at Polmos is done through the dark polar winter, so bright lighting is needed approximately 12 hours a day during the season. В период до 2015-2016 года на ленивоческой базе Полмос использовалась обычная генераторная установка, которая заводилась исключительно по времени. То есть мы ее заводили в период с 17.00 до 12.00, ну и иногда еще с 3 часов дня и до 12.00. То есть в утреннее и ночное время электричество на данной базе отсутствовало. A mobile power generation system with an integrated wind turbine and new diesel generator was installed in 2015, providing the reindeer herding farm with an independent electricity supply. Also a complex set of energy efficient measures to reduce electricity and diesel consumption at the reindeer farm were implemented. Since the integrated wind diesel power system was installed in April 2015, it has dramatically improved living and working conditions in Polmos, providing an uninterrupted and reliable supply of energy. The new system has reduced fuel costs and the harmful emissions that produce black carbon, carbon dioxide, nitrogen dioxide and sulfur dioxide. The Tundra community is very pleased with the integrated wind diesel system. And the results of this project suggest the potential to successfully scale up energy infrastructure investments in the Arctic that are cost-effective and better for the environment.